Okay, there's a couple of hints if you look at these pages. For instance, this is standard 2-3, which means it's the section in our book titled 2-3. And what form was that one going talking about? So that means I know when I start doing this page, what equation should I be thinking about? What is standard forms equation? Okay. I'm keeping that in mind as I start reading through this because this section is going to be assessing whether I can use that equation. It says at Allie's Burgers or Bergs, you can order a cheeseburger for $5 or a chicken burger for $4. You have two $20 bills to spend. How much total do I have then? $40. That's my C. And I'm going to say that a cheeseburger is an X and a chicken burger is a Y. How am I going to set that equation up then? 5x mm -hmm. plus 4y equals 40. When I have standard form, what is it most useful for finding as far as graphing? I can use the cover up method to find what? The intercepts. So if I'm covering this up, I'm going to get my y intercept, which is what? Okay, so y intercept is 10. What's my x intercept? Okay, if this is my x, these are cheeseburgers. And y would be going up the y axis, and that's going to be what? And I'm going to be lazy and not number these because it's just 1 through 10. Right, here's the zero. The y-intercept is 10. It's right up here. Where am I going to put my x-intercept? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, and then I can draw my line. So we haven't really used these very much, but I want you guys to just think along with me about what this means. If I'm buying this right here, what am I buying? Eight cheeseburgers. Am I getting any chicken burgers? And if I'm buying this instead, I'm getting what? Ten chicken burgers and how many cheeseburgers? Okay. So that's what this is asking here. This is saying if I'm getting this point, I'm getting zero of these, but I'm getting all of this, and I'm maxing out my money. This is saying give three possible combinations that you could order and spend all of the money. Where are these represented on the graph? Well, let's go through the graph and find some points. This one here is at one, two, three, four, five cheeseburgers and one, two, three, four chicken burgers. Do you see what I just found there? So this is saying four comma, oh no, other way, five comma four. <coughs> and that's saying that this is cheeseburgers and this is chicken burgers. Could we find two more points on there? Okay, yeah, yeah. there's a couple ways you could do this. You could write it out with words. You could make a table showing cheeseburgers and chicken burgers and you could put those points in to show how many of each you'd be getting and using all forty dollars and I'm assuming that they don't charge tax in this world right okay does that help clarify this page good